I've been wearing this hat and this shirt for approximately three days. Am I ashamed? No. Does it smell a little bit? You won't know because you're not here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a good quarantine, whatever. Hopefully this is over soon. I shouldn't be touching my face. So I had the bright idea of, I, as you know, doing wood burning all the time. I don't wanna do just some boring wood burning video because I don't know if you guys actually like them. If you actually like how I normally do videos, then tell me. But I'm gonna mix it up a little bit today. I am wood burning, but you guys aren't gonna be watching it. You're just gonna be watching the end result. But I'm going to be trying to wood burn this realistic bird. And while I'm doing this bird, I'm going to be answering some questions. Now, I don't have enough followers or friends in order to ask me those assumptions things because I would totally do that. But I'm going to be doing a 21 questions while wood burning. I think that I can get all of these questions answered and have this done in the time frame that it takes me to answer those questions. Now, because it is a realistic bird, I might hit and miss. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. 21 questions while wood burning. I hope you enjoy it. Yeah, let's get started on that because that's fun and then you guys will get to know me a little bit more. I mean, based off the questions that I just found on the internet, it's behind the camera. So I will be looking off to the side a lot. Question number one, while I start. If you had a time machine, where would you go back in time or would you visit the future? I've seen all of the Back to the Future movies and I think it's a bad idea to go back in the past because sometimes you can change it. I am not a fan of seeing what the future might look like, so I would say I'd go to the past. Would you rather have a home on the beach or in the mountains? I am a mountains girl. I like to visit the beach. I'll have my second home at the beach. Favorite game as a child? As a child, I remember we always played uh, Twister. We didn't really play a lot of games when I was younger. We didn't really start playing games until I was like middle school. Is that a child? What food do you crave most often? I am craving probably Chinese food. But here currently, I have been wanting nothing but chicken parm from a local Italian restaurant because it is amazing. Trey's done. If you could visit one place on earth, where would you go? Well, because of the fact I can't go anywhere right now, I would go anywhere on earth. But I mean, to be honest, I always wanna go to California. Still hopefully on the radar for 2020. Anything with views. And it's not like city views. I like more nature views. I go to Montana on heartbeat. What would your dream house look like? I explained this to a friend earlier and I'm going to explain it again because this is the perfect, perfect thing. I want to have a house on land with a barn. I don't want a big house. I just want a clean, modern house and some animals. Probably some llamas. Oh my gosh. We're only on number seven and I'm not even done with this stupid bird foot. If you could own any three cars, what would they be? Okay, I've heard this question asked multiple times to people. I'm not a fancy car girl. Now trucks, different story. I'm looking to get a new car right now and I don't want anything that's all fancy dancy 50k. I would like a modern car like the one that I have now, maybe a little bit newer. Ford Raptor. I'd love to have that truck. I don't know, I don't really have any other vehicles that I really care for, I don't. I didn't think about these questions, so I don't know, I'd have to do some research. What makes you the angriest? This video is not long enough for me to tell you what makes me the angriest. What always brings a smile to your face? Oh, dogs, hands down. Okay, now this sounds really dumb, but when I mow my yard and I get clean lines, I get the biggest smile on my face because it's so beautiful. Which song reminds you the most of your life? There's like four billion zillion songs out. How am I supposed to pick one? I forgot that you existed by T-Swizzle. I have a lot of people that I need to forget that existed, so. Which is more important, truth or happiness? I would probably have to say truth. If someone's being honest with you, then they should tell you the truth. You don't want to be lied to and feel happy because in the long run, you're just not going to be happy. Maybe. Check up. Would you rather be rich or famous? Rich, I guess, because sometimes being in the limelight is not fun from what I've heard. I'm not famous, so I don't know. If you were a superhero, what would what powers would you have? Uh, invisibility, super strength. I don't really care to fly, I'm scared of heights. If you were an animal, what would you be and why? Well, I would not be this bird because this bird's looking pretty sad. Probably a dog or a llama. People don't normally get llamas wrong. They always get alpacas wrong. I've been obsessed with llamas and dogs for my whole life, that's why. If you could 
be trained up in any profession by top professionals, what profession would you choose? Well, I mean, obviously it's fun to learn more in art. I think it'd be cool to be an actor. I liked acting when I was younger. What's something you can do that most can't? I can remember most any movie line. I don't know if most people can do that. My knuckles double jointed. I can draw. Most people can't do that. What do you have a hard time with but most people find easy? Change. Freaking hate change. What is the weirdest nickname you have ever had? Well, the only one that can come to the top of my head is in elementary school, I was being taught reading by a reading teacher, because guess what, I wasn't smart all the time. This lady always called me Munchkin, like a little Munchkin, 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 because I was always smaller, and then I had to grow spurt in middle school, and then I finally got to the height of being taller than Kelsey. What is your favorite item of clothing? I really like sweatshirts. Who likes wearing jeans? That's the thing. Who sits around and wears jeans just to chill? If you could jump into a pool of something, what would it be? Well, not water. I can't swim. It has to be something like foam. I don't want to jump into food. That's gross. And number 21, final question. I will put my pen down for this. If you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? There is over one thing that I would like to change about myself, but number one on the top of the list, I want better kneecaps. I have dislocated my kneecap three times playing sports. If that would stop happening, I'd greatly appreciate it. That is 21 questions. I'm gonna finish this and then I'll show you guys end result. It actually did not take me that long to finish this after answering the 21st question. Take that questionnaire. It looks so nice. And if you want to buy, I will have my Facebook link down below. Website is on its way, in progress, under construction. I hope you guys like this video of me answering questions. I'll see you guys next week with something else. I already know what the video is and I can tell you right now, I was deeply offended. Please make sure to like this video. Please comment down below if you have any ideas for me to wood burn or video ideas in general. My brain is just like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. We will see y'all next week with something that I already know.